to undo what I did. Barry, what are you doing? Our kids are going to want to see this. And I want to be very, very careful. I know some people want to be not spoiled at all. This is, and I emphasize, minor spoilers. Minor spoilers only. I will not do any major spoilers. I will leave things a little ambiguous. Let us get right to it. I'm already probably showing the poster art, which is very, very interesting and impressive. So some new posters for The Flash. But let us get to some of the leaked images or things that showed up in TV spots people may not have noticed. Now, we knew this was going to happen, that they were going to have Iris. And the rumor is that she was just going to be cut from the whole film entirely. She's just there for two seconds. Apparently that is not true. Iris will be in the film for a little bit. From the leaks, it doesn't appear she'll be a major part of the plot, but I would assume, I guess, yeah, she and Barry are going out, or their boyfriend and girlfriend. That was teased in Justice League, and so her debut was technically with Snyder, and she was supposed to be big in that film, but, you know, complications happened. We are also being given different versions of The Flash. Again, I want to keep it ambiguous. I'll just say if you've seen TV versions of The Flash, some of those versions, yes, they will appear. Those cameos are fairly brief, but we will get different versions of the Flash beyond the two Flashes we've seen in a lot of the trailers. And this isn't a lot, but we will also be getting some minor characters with Patty and Albert, if you know the French. So yeah, we're definitely going to get a little bit more with Barry than might be the case from the trailers. It just seems like we're going to zip into the adventure. No, they're going to build up who the Flash is, and the cast around him. So we will be giving a little background with Barry before we jump into the multiverse saga. And now we're going to get into that. I'm not going to spoil any element of the plot, but I will note some of the people who have rumored to appear will appear. But again, it's rather minor, so don't get your hopes up too much. But they do appear. And the reason they appear is because, of course, they're tapping into the multiverse. So, yes, we are going to see different versions of Superman. We're also going to see different versions of Wonder Woman. So we're seeing the Gal Gadot version. But we are also going to see other versions of Wonder Woman. And even, yes, other versions of Batman. Now, how does this work? Are they just going to use footage? Are we going to see them on a screen? It's unclear. But, yes, they do appear... It's not a big part of the movie, but these cameos will happen. But again, I don't know for sure how long it will be. Again, remember, the version given at CinemaCon was not finished. So they're deliberately not giving the full picture yet because they want to preserve some secrets because you have to pay for it. So yes, we are getting different versions of the Justice League, Wonder Woman, Superman. And yes, it's confirmed that Aquaman will appear. In fact, apparently he and Barry will have a conversation now. It's going to get a little confusing because of the multiverse. The Aquaman he speaks to, as far as I know, is the Snyder Aquaman. It's going to get complicated. I'm not going to spoil the plot here, but they're calling from different universes. So the Batman is from the Burton universe, but some people are from the Snyder universe. I know some subscriber pointed out to me that doesn't make sense. There are things that don't make sense in the trailer with Batman. I agree. But it is the Burton Batman. It's obviously not the literal Burton Batman from the film because that wouldn't make any sense. But it's basically a similar version of that character will appear. So yes, it is basically the Burton version of Batman. Again, it doesn't quite make sense because technically Robin should be there or Nightwing. But there we are. So they're adjusting the history to fit the Flash. But yes, we are going to get Iris. We're going to get different versions of the Flash, different versions of Superman different versions of Batman, and I want to be careful here. I don't know if Ben Affleck and Bruce Wayne meet each other directly, but Ben is in the film. He's not just a cameo. He is a big part of the plot, so a lot to look forward to with The Flash.